Thanks, Ed. Tonight we're continuing our Reporters on the Run series as Rosa Duarte and Hillary Lane train for the upcoming Runner's World Half and Festival in Bethlehem. This week they're talking to the experts about how to pick out the perfect running shoe. Check it out. So many shoes, so little time. You want to run in comfortable running clothes for sure, but the most important gear is the running shoe. Chief Running Officer for Runner's World Magazine, Bart Yasso, met up with us at the Arvark Sports Shop in Bethlehem, along with the magazine's gear editor, Brian Boyle, to give us the lowdown on running shoes. It's tempting to buy online. The prices are amazing and the mm -hmm. convenience is, is nice where it's delivered right to your door. But here at the store, they're going to sit you down, size your foot, make sure you're in the proper fit, and they're also going to ask you about your training plan. Experts can also tell what kind of runner you are if you bring in a pair of shoes you've been using. Staff here will study actually the sole of the shoe and determine whether you're running true to form or perhaps rolling on the inside or rolling on the outside. The most common mistake? Boyle says new runners tend to stick to the same size they would wear in a dress shoe. But when it comes to running, he recommends going a half size to a whole size bigger. You don't want it to be too big. You don't want to swim around in the forefoot, for instance. You certainly don't want it to be too small. That's where you risk chafing and blisters and maybe even injury. During my visit at the store, I got to test a new pair on the treadmill to make sure the fit was just right. While a salesman looked at the shoes I've been running in and even had me walk barefoot to determine my gait cycle. All shoes considered, these experts warn against picking a shoe based on its color or style. Instead, a good fit along with where you plan on running and what your running goals are should be considered to help you find the perfect shoe. There's not just one shoe that fits everyone. You've got to find out what type of runner you are and what the best running shoe would be that's going to fit you. Follow these tips and you too can say I do to the perfect shoe. All right. Well, don't forget, you can follow Rosa and Hillary's training plans online at WFMZ.com. They are blogging about their progress, and each week they'll post the workout plans they're following. You can find it all by clicking on the link under the community tab at the top of the homepage.